Fed up. That's how a group of angry and motivated local homeowners say they feel about wild, dangerous, and illegal behavior on the streets. ATV riders clogging streets, taunting officers, just one part of the problem. But oh. the biggest part, according to these homeowners, is the lack of police response. And that's why they have started a social media campaign aimed at getting attention from City Hall to the state capitol. Uh, Fox 5's Morris Diggs has the story. This is the petition being circulated on social media from a group called Concerned Citizens United. And it's not simply homeowners from the Atlanta area, but citizens from across the metro who are demanding law enforcement show a greater impact on crime. The number one bullet point in this petition, the lawlessness, they say, from dirt bike and motorcycle riders. We're really tired of the uptick in crime and we're really tired of being told that crime is down. We're not noticing it. Even dirt bike riding on congested streets has reason enough to be fearful and outraged, says Amber Connor, who is spearheading the petition drive. She says not enough is being done to maintain order in the city and in some communities in the suburbs. So weird sitting here like sitting ducks if we happen to go to Fellini's Pizza or if we happen to be driving from soccer to back back home we might run into people who are going to cut us off spit on our windshield uh, throw something at our windshield while officers just stand by across the country there are cities like Miami who on a given holiday see their streets taken over by the dirt bike riders here locally it doesn't have to be a holiday but when every Thursday night or Sunday night, there's large groups of people complaining, calling, um, asking why you have over 50 to 200 ATVs driving up and down the city. They're running red lights. What's going on? Right. Um, the APD says our hands are tied. We're not allowed to do that. We can't chase them. That puts everyone at risk. City politicians contend there are not enough regulations, especially covering some of the favorite routes of the dirt bike riders, state roads like Peachtree and Ponce de Leon. One state lawmaker questions that assertion. APD and the state patrol need to get in the same room and with citizens and so that the citizens can see the Atlanta Police Department and the state patrol working together and not passing the buck. Other concerns being expressed by this group, they are calling for transparency and how crimes are accounted for, like car break-ins and carjackings, and they want dedicated patrols at high-risk areas like gas stations. From Zone 2 in Buckhead, I'm Morse Diggs, Fox 5 News.